What is happening, y'all? Welcome back. Um, so as many of you pointed out, it was just right here. I just had to just run run through the room. I was what we call door blind, where you've been in a path so many times that you miss the completely open door that's right in front of you. But hey, look at that. Now we got another. Be an extra Estus last course. That'll be nice. And uh, actually, I don't think I even burned the bonfire shard that I picked up on the way to that place. Let's go take care of that as well. Go, uh, go talk to our little friend Andre. Do you have is it stone? You still don't have you have all the element stones. Oh no, these are just the aura ones. Never mind. You don't have anything good. What the hell, lady? Why are you even a merchant? You suck. Uh reinforce. Bark straight sword. It's the yeah, bleedy one. Pretty I really need to decide what I want to use. There's, there's too many damn weapons. Like I like the Kirk hammer because it's like, hey, this weapon is a bloodborne weapon. But I also like the idea of Morns because it's like, hey, you typically never get to use this shit. And I'm like, oh, that's right, I don't. I definitely do not. Absorption. 25% causes the caster to move slowly. Huh. Don't think I want that. Um. Man. Blunts. I need blunts. Go up, get Rosaria. I may even be able to... I mean, it's it's as much as I hate going back through this place, it is worth it just for Rosaria so that I can respec and min-max. Oh, oh god damn it. So usually you have to step off the button for that to, to trigger, I guess, the the casting animation counter doesn't step off. No, sorry, it's outside. Outside and up the ladder. Now we get to fight knights on catwalks. to shard from killing that guy. I'll take it. down to grab loot. I don't think there's loot down here. I think it's just this guy. And his friends. This is the one with the loot. 
surprised I haven't found any of the shield infusions yet. I remember those were like the last time I played the mod, they were plentiful. They were all over the place, but I mean, to be fair, you could just find them all over whenever you want. Church pick, that's dope. Not that I never really, uh, never really did much with. First white ring, another thrall pick. Neat, but that's weird. EDD, but there's 25 strength requirement. That is really odd. Right, let's see how they've changed up the catwalks here. They seem better lit. I don't know if that's just me, but. What's up, great sword, bro? Damn. Dude just got laid out. The holy flame. I remember that. It's like a miracle pyromancy combo catalyst. You could throw dope balls of lightning. Oh, God. It's okay. This is where I wanted to go. Patches sunlight great sword? What the fuck? How the fuck does Patches have that? The Beast Cutter? Crypt Black Sword. Deep shockwave, similar to Perseverance. That sounds alright, let's pick up that guy. Grant. Grant's a solid pickup. Smelter hammer is brammed. 2 HP every second. And it has holy wrath. Jesus Christ. I gotta buy the gear and throw it into the well. Sunlight greatsword. Greatsword imbues the strength of sun. Greatsword contains the very power of the sun. Perhaps as a relic of one-sided adoration. Raise the sword of loop praise in the sun. To boost attack and damage absorption for self, so it gives you. It's a great sword that basically gives you. Um, what is that fucking move? Secret oath. Crit black sword could be pretty potent. Being an ultra great sword with this undead wrath thing that sounds dope. Spin slash. Holy wrath on Grant. So Grant and Brammed are two other alternatives. Great Hammer, Great Hammer, Earth, Holy Wrath. But at 40,000 and 55,000. I free consumption. I'd probably go for Brammed. Just because I'd take 2 HP per second over FP cost of Miracles. And they both have Holy Wrath. Still 55,000? Thanks, good cop. 55,000, bro? Forty fifty six. Let me see something. Bram doesn't even have the faith requirement. That might be that might be what we want here. Fifty five thousand though. God damn it, patches. Can't find it. 
Do I have anything I could nom down for that? I don't know. I'd have to sell stuff. I want those weapons to compare. To do my max minute. It could also be the case that I'll just find these things as I play the game. But just at first glance, those both look like... Um, they look like basically just superior version of Morns. Because... I mean, they they both... Well, the one... Grant also had the 30-20 the split. They all have that, that rage-type move. But, um... The one has FP reduction, the other has health gain. Looks shinier than I remember. I'm the Dark Paladin. Let me go try this ability out, see if it, see if it claps. Ooh. Be gone! It's the only thing is it's a very close weapon, like it's, it's rolling attack is kind of ass. Down slam. Not a good weapon if you're ever surrounded, but. 239. It feels like it's hitting way harder than 239. I don't know. I am. There's, there's a lot. There's a lot to decide here. Um, let me rest. I want to see if Patches leaves. Or if he's still there. I'm trying to think. I think after this he goes back to uh back to base. And I'm so torn. There's like so many good weapons now. I mean, and that undead wrath thing, that's brutal. And the requirements on this are like non-existent. 20 and 8? Like, dude. Weighs a lot, but. Holy Crypt Black Sword. Like, these numbers can't be right. I'm seeing a 407. I wasn't even getting that with this, was I? No, I'm getting 523. And poise filled AoE explosion. God, I can't decide. Uh, what are what are the ones? What are you offering here exactly? I don't want beast cutter. Spin slash no. So that well, it's a great sword. I'm using ultra, so let me shy away from that. Chicken leg, I'm not gonna worry about. So it's Grant weighs 20, 140, 56, 160, 83, what the fuck? Higher base and better scaling? Alright, I, I need 55,000 souls, that's all this can come down to. I need, I need the souls to pick that up. Um, and to get that... I mean, well, if I really want to farm, I could... I could get some of that Primordial Titanite stuff. I mean, we could go after Deacons, but I think once Deacons are dead, I want to say... Um, I think Patches leaves as soon as we kill the Deacons. I'm not... I'm not 100%, but I, I'm, like, almost 100%. Um... 
Do I have anything I could sacrifice worth to get those souls? 55,000, huh? Um. I mean, that stuff is all... I could start sacrificing armor, but at like a hundred a pop, like none of this is worthwhile. Uh, uh. Yeah, I would need to. Oh, fuck it. Let's just kill. Let's kill the. We'll kill the deacons. If he moves, he moves. But I don't know. No. No, I don't kill the deacons. Because the thing is, I, I really want to get that hammer. That hammer looks like it could be. Like, that's, that's what I'm looking for here, you know? That's what I need. Um. And for all I know, maybe he leaves and it's no longer in his inventory. Maybe he has that in his inventory because he's in the cathedral right now and it's a cathedral weapon. So I cannot tempt fate. Instead, I must murder oh. other things. Um, great wood. Let's, uh, I'll clap the Abyss Watchers Happy. twice. Actually, I might be able... Let me go... Uh, Sorry, I got it that S to sure. Let me use that. Oh, his inventory is. I think he has every weapon that I've picked up, he now carries. Pretty cool. Pretty. All right, so we're gonna <clears throat> we're gonna go try fighting Super Gunder again. Let me uh, get rid of some stuff here real fast. I got a lot of got a lot of junk. Last time, I'm assuming that the the nightmare version of Gundur is still alive. Except now, I am obviously big beefy boy. Whereas before, I was like still really early, and he basically showed up to beat my shit in. That ain't gonna happen this time, Gundy. Why am I doing the parry thing? I can just probably do this. Damn, he still hits fucking hard. If the parry, it hurts more than it's worth. You know what? This is stupid. Let me just let me just do this how I do this best. By that, I mean putting on that. Ow! Stop it, Gunder.
way, way too close to that ledge there. like one of the most embarrassing boss fights I think I've ever done. I just, I don't know, I got two parries off and I really wanted to like get the damage on the parries, but that's, no, no, that's, that's stupid. That's stupid. Let me just go in and do this the old fashioned way. And by that, I mean just dodging and beating his ass because that's smart and that's how I win this fight. Like, as soon as I stopped parrying and started just fucking fighting, things were going fine. And if I had actually focused on that the whole goddamn time, instead of having to use a shit ton of Estus to heal from whiffed parries, I probably would have been fine. Titanite and how many souls? Oh, 37. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Now we can go buy that needle weapon. Which, I mean, at the end of the day, Morn's Great Hammer is basically just the ramp to Dark Souls 3. Bramped is the OG. It's the Demon Souls one. For those of you that uh, recently watched the Demon Souls playthrough, when I was fighting, uh, you may remember the area that had the weird demon babies. Right? The guy I was fighting there, that hammer that he was using, that's Bramped. Which now will belong to me. Bramped. Bramped. Um. I do need to buy all these for a Katarina, bro. Uh, well, I'd rather have poison arrows. <laughs> for the, the few times I need to use a bow, poison arrows come in clutch, probably. All right, so it's about the same size. And how's the moveset on this big old thing? 
right, we got the we got the AOE sweeps. I like that. We got a big old pancake smash. We got running pancake smash. Do we have the AOE roll? We do, and of course we have the. And the best thing, I don't even need to worry about getting my faith up to use this thing. I can already use it with two hands. I'd have to say the only the only problem is I need to upgrade this with a uh, stone to make it useful. Die! Feel the power of my whole penis. That nukes. That nukes. I need to get. I need. Uh, I want to bring this thing into the deacons fight and just fucking melt them. Like, now I'm feeling like a paladin. You know, I know we've been doing a lot of swords, but this thing, this is a paladin weapon. Giant hammer and the weapon art just just explodes holy energy all over the place, along with poise boost. This is a paladin weapon. This is basically Yorms, but just better. I mean, it weighs less. Yorms might be a little bit stronger. I don't know, to be honest. I'd have to, like, pull... I'd have to look at the values to figure it out. Um... But I'll tell you what I am going to look at. I'm going to find out where the hell I can find more of these gems. Because the way I'm going right now, I uh, I obviously need I need blunt gems. I need blunt gems. And so I'm going to find out um, if there's like something I can do to buy them. Or whatever the case is, this, this mod has an entire wiki dedicated to it. So I'm going to look some stuff up. Uh, after that, we will tackle... Um, deacons and then we'll make our way through uh somewhere i don't know we'll figure it out anyway stay tuned catch you guys soon enough